I kind of uh, got my uh, butt cheek all raw. Uh, but the stem cells are working because stem cells are there are like morph cells. They're like mighty morphing angels, and they went down there and they repaired my butt cheek. So now it's all good again. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Stem cells are like Charlie Sheen's. Uh, yeah, it's all about winning. Because they sense what is wrong in your body and they, they go to the place exactly and to repair it. Like if you need eyeball cells, they turn into eyeball cells. Uh -huh. <laughs> like my instance, they, I needed some butt cheek cells, they turn into butt cheek cells. But except for the hip cartilage, of course the blood doesn't go there, so that's why we have to manually take these stem cells out uh, from, from this bone marrow draw and implant it into where I, I'm, you know, I have problem with the cartilage. So that's, that was easy for me to understand. So I met the doctor, like I said, he was very pleasant. And uh, he says, let me explain to you by showing you a uh, hip model that was going to happen. So he left the room and I thought that he was going to bring back Justin Bieber or somebody, a hip model. No, when he came back, he actually brought like little plastic model like you see in the biology class, like made in China, little rubbery. You can move the leg around and see what's underneath it. I feel dirty when I do that, you know, like, what's underneath this thing, this ball and socket? So it's all about ball and socket. What? I'm talking about the anatomy. Um, so he was showing me that where they're going to inject right into where the damages are, which is right by the femur, which is the ball in, you know, at the socket place. So with a pinpoint accuracy. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, I told him, I said, well, I'm kind of a little bit of a, like, n nervous wreck type of person. Will you do the bone marrow draw? Because he said he was going to draw from my uh, hip iliac crest. I go, yeah, how do you know? That was the name I used to dance under, hip iliac crest. Uh, <laughs> I made myself laughter. Hip Ilya Crest. Yeah, you can still see me on, on other YouTube channels. Um, but <laughs> no, I was a little nervous, so he go, okay, this is what we'll do. <laughs> so he read me a script, and I went to the nearby Walmart to get it filled. The guy looked at me and he goes, I've never seen any script written like this. I go, just do it. Okay, so he typed it up exactly as it is written. The patient would take this Valium four hours before procedure, and if three hours before procedure, she's real, real nervous, like, I'm going now with her, or her and she can take another with Valium, and if it's an hour before procedure, she don't feel nervous, she can take another one, and go, yeah, yeah, you're happening, doc. So he exactly read my mind. So now I'm all, uh, I'm like high as a kite. Uh, <laughs> well, first I had to get my blood drawn, uh, the reason why is is this the so-called this uh, super mix of stem cell that's going to be uh, uh, aspirated from my bone marrow will be mixed with this uh, uh, platelets <laughs> platelets. I know platelets sound like in cell. You get them in China, one of No, your blood has platelets in them. So you will try it if you uh, cut yourself. It, you know, it, it stopped bleeding because the playlist was in action and the playlist has a lot of, a lot of good stuff, like, I don't know, just a lot of good stuff. Anyways, <laughs> I don't know what they are, but it, it's better than these stuff. So they were uh, uh, taking my blood and uh, um, separate the playlist and I guess they put in the bowl and then I imagine there's another bowl and they're going to put the, uh, the bone marrow with the stem cells and then they're going to put something else uh, to hold it together. So it's like an army.